Everything should be working. I have the um, goals and stuff in the corner. I have um, the chat will come up in the top left corner. My PNG is good. Game's good. I think we're okay to get started. I'm gonna test to see if my com if my controller will work with this because this game came out on every platform. It is available on PC. It is available on Xbox, Switch and PlayStation, I believe. I think it's on everything. So, if you like what you see, honestly, get this game. It's so cute. And it's, it's I think it's like 30 bucks. It was supposed to be like 15% off on release day or like permanently on Steam, but it wasn't working right. So, unfortunately, that, they're, they're, I think they're doing refunds for people on Steam because of it. I'm not sure. I think they're just refunding the 15%. I'm not sure, but absolutely check this game out. It looks so adorable, and it's got over 30 dinosaurs. And it's a farming game. It's a cozy little farming game. And they come in multitude of colors, even albinos and melanistics, which I think is absolutely adorable. So I will. this is my first time playing. I, I didn't play the demo when it was out, so I absolutely have no idea how to play. So it's going to be a learning experience. So let's get started. Oh, there's the audio. Sorry for blasting your ears. I did try to turn it down, but if it's too loud, let me know, and I'll turn it down a little bit. I can't even hear myself talking. The adventure begins. Welcome to Paleo Pines, a peaceful island full of dinosaurs. Let's create your character, and you can buy new clothes later, so relax and pick something you like. I'm gonna go with that. This looks too pale. I don't like it. Hi, hun! Also, quit calling me short, you nerd. Um, lighter green. Oh. Oh, there's a fat. What? Oh, there's the natural colors. Okay. You can be an old man if you want. That's closest I'm getting to it, I think. Hold up. That one. I like that one better. Huh? Sorry, that gave me whiplash, but I'm going with this one. Yeah, I'm going with that one. <laughs> um. Is there a way to determine if I'm a male or female, though? Or, like, what? How do you... Oh, you base it on your hair. Okay. There's no gender. Okay. Hey, my friend Lost called me short too. But you are though. I am 6'1", thank you. Listen, I'm, I'm maybe 5'4", five, 5'3", five, but that doesn't mean you get to call me short all the time, you pee, pee Oh. That's nice. Let's see some rep. Awesome. Yeah, I'm going with this hair. I like this hair. Um, sweater? I kind of like the sweater. I like the sweater a lot. <laughs> Strawberries. Oof. <laughs> Khaki pants. There's also, like, full-blown outfits, too, which is nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with the sweater and this combo. Looks dumb, but I don't care, honestly. Yes, it does. No, it does not. You're being mean. Honestly, this ensemble looks about right. Alright, this is what we're going with. <laughs> I'm gonna remove... Uh... You know what? Fuck it. There. <laughs> Granny sells all kinds of seeds, discover new areas, and she'll sell more. Okay. 
There's Lucky Hat. Oh, by the way, that's your starter dinosaur right there. And, it, and her name is Lucky. And she's the supposed last of her kind. We're supposed to try to figure out if we, where it happened to her kind, I guess? I was given a brief summary of how this game works. <laughs> so... Uh oh, she's too big. Too big. Too big for the house. Funny. Such a cute baby dino. Again, I have my controller plugged in. I don't know if this has controller support, but I'm really hoping it does because I genuinely hate playing on anything else. <laughs> but it's on all platforms, so I assume it has controller support. You're here, Paleo Pines. Oh, lucky, it's exactly how I imagined it. I does not have controller support, apparently, so that is unfortunate. Well, maybe not exactly. I mean, it's a little run down, but... You're right, we'll definitely make it work. I'm assuming that's the pen for the dinosaur. Oh. Okay. Today was long, but we made it. Well done, Lucky. Look at pet the dinosaurs. That's a little cutie. Here, let me grab you a treat. You must be hungry. Yes. Why did I just have a random okay, a random carrot in my inventory? Okay, cool. <laughs> Sorry, girl. That was the last one. Well, I didn't eat them all. Found lucky. Oh, it looks cozy, just like your old sleeping patch. Look, there's even a dreamstone. <sighs> Speaking of sleeping patches, time for me to go to find my own. Good night, Lucky. Oh my god, look at all those fucking rocks. Uh oh, something's fallen in front of the ladder. Maybe Lucky can help. Oh, okay, figured out how to run by accident. Sorry, Lucky, I know you're tired, but I need your help so I can sleep too. It'll be quick, I promise. Yeah. Told you it would be quick. Now I'm gonna just go put her back. Alright, Lucky, for real this time. Okay. That ladder is so fucking broken. I wouldn't trust that with my life. Okay. Cause I don't feel like- if this game crashes, I don't feel like redoing the whole beginning again. So, I'm just gonna do that. I'd rather make sure. Morning, Lucky! Now, about breakfast. Oh, I didn't get to read that, but okay. Oh, hello! <laughs> I don't... See, Owen? Sometimes you just gotta follow the tracks and see where they take you. Oh, my guns and tongues. Mari, are you seeing this? I see it, but I, I swear my blinkers are messing with me. Is is that a real parasof... I don't know how to fucking say that. Parasofolof... Parasorlophus? It's a parasaur. It's a, it's a fucking parasaur. I'm just gonna call it parasaur. <laughs> what a beauty she is. 
See, I told you it was worth the rush. When I first spotted the tracks, I was so tempted to race after them, but... No, I said to myself, Mari, you can't chase these without Owen, even if it takes him an hour to gather up all his things. <laughs> it wasn't an hour. No, you're right. More like two. Preparedness is important. Anyway, it's a pleasure to meet you and your parasaur. You know, we haven't seen one since... Actually, we've never seen one. Uh-oh, I hope you didn't come to Paleo Pines looking for herds of parasaur galloping through the hills. Now, now, hold on. They're definitely around, right? At least we think they are. Mari, you've seen tracks. Well, sure, but that's all I've ever seen. They show up from time to time, so they must be around here somewhere. Imagine a real parasaur living right here in Ver Veridi Viridian Valley? Okay. I have no idea what dinosaurs they have in the back, by the way. I have no idea what those are. Wait, are you planning on moving in? You are planning on moving in, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, new neighbors. Owen, oh, you bring anything with you that could stand in for an impromptu housewarming gift? Oh, mm, well, I only had time to pack for what I thought was a spur of the moment field study. So, like, three of everything and enough clothes for a month? Ah, I happen to have just the thing. Really, Owen? One of your journals? Yes, just so happens I brought two blank ones in case we discovered something remarkable. And we did. Trust me, if you're starting a ranch, there's a lot you'll need to remember. Write it all down and you'll never forget. Actually, that makes sense. Here, I've got something for you, too. A pocket full of herbivore food? Yeah, it's all I brought. Besides, that's a hungry-looking parasaur, and you can't exactly eat a journal. You'd be surprised. Did bro eat a journal in his life? <laughs> what? That's some of the best herbivore food that shells can buy, courtesy of Corlin's Randoms and Abundance. If you're looking to, for more of that or anything else, Pebble Plaza should be your next destination. It's not far, and it's got everything. Hey, make sure you meet Mar- Make sure you meet Marlo, he'll get you anything you need to fix up this pen and the rest of, of your ranch. Owen! Rude. What? Look at it, it's a mess. We'd better go, sorry about Owen. What? What did I say? Hope to see you around sometime, and good luck with moving in. Yes, good luck, and trust me, that journal will be your new best friend. Er, second best friend. Bye now. She does upset Lucky. <laughs> oh. Quest added the parasaur fossil and some other. Okay. Lucky needs attention. Oh. Terrace? Is that like spring? Uh, oh, it gives me a full calendar and everything. No pen. Settling in. Meet the locals. I've only met two of six. Okay. Do I even have money? What's this? Shenanigan? Terracy picnic. Bongo and paprika, huh? Uh, okay. Okay. Dreamstone, so I'm not worried about that. Jesus Christ. I've done the dinosaur. I don't know what exactly this dinosaur can fully do aside from clearing debris and stuff, but. Oh 
god, she's fast. What's this? Hmm. I don't know where the town is. I have zero fucking clue. I don't think they give me a map. <laughs> I didn't see anything about a map. Viridian Valley discovered. Look at all that dinosaurs. I don't want that. Oh my goodness, look at those. I don't know what colors those guys are, but I can't really do anything. Oh, the, oh hello. Can I grab that? Oh, I can't grab it, okay. Dudes, I hello. <laughs> well, don't just stand there, Goblin. Come over and say hello. Are your name's Agami? I'm assuming that's how you say that. Ah, are you the wee beaky who just moved into that old ranch? Welcome to Paleo Pines. Finally, that place needs a good weeding, like a Warasaurus needs watermelons. What the fuck is a Warasaurus? <laughs> My name is Agami, but everyone around here just calls me Granny. You must be looking for Pebble Plaza. Come on, let old granny introduce you to the neighborhood. Oh, if you don't mind, leave your steed out here. Too many whatnots and whiplits inside to have eager dino tails swinging about. Great galloping galleys, is that a pair of... a parasaur? I haven't seen one of them in the valley since I was knee-high to an over-raptor. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm still knee-high to an over-raptor. But I make up for it with charm and hair. Anyways, yeah, Steve's gotta stay out here, even if she is a parasaur. Wow. Alright, Lucky, you gotta stay out here. Sorry, Lucky, I won't be long. Don't wander off. Right this way. After me. I'd be so nervous leaving my pet dinosaur just randomly somewhere. I don't feel like, like, I'd, I'd, I'd like, I get it though, because the dinosaurs are pretty big. Welcome to Pebble Plaza. If we don't got it, you don't need it. Actually, it's more of a, like, if we don't got it, you're out of luck. <laughs> At least until the path to Dapplewood is open again. But that's a problem for another day. We've got enough, and that's enough. Pebble Plaza's place for gathering and trade. If you got crop seeds, bits of wood and stone, someone here will trade for it. Plus, you can trade anything for shells here. We use these for sort of a common currency. Go on. Here's a few for me, in case you see any th something you like. Don't spend it all in one place. 250 shells, oh my god. All right. Here, let me give you a quick tour. That's my stall over there. I've got seeds to grow just about anything from pumpkins to pineapples. Well, usually anyway. These days it's more like potatoes to potatoes. Slim pickings these days, I'm afraid. Did I mention the path to Dapplewood is blocked? I'm sure I did. On top of the hill, you usually find Pippin. Not today, though. It's baking day. Pippin makes poppins. Pippin's real sweet, and poppins are, er, well, I'll let you decide for yourself. Tell you what, you can come back tomorrow and meet them. They'll sort you out with a tasty snack. Well, er, a snack. Right. See that lab behind me? That's Corlin. If you're after anything, after anything, Corlin's the best place to start. He's got everything from flowers to fibrous... Fibidibbers? What the fuck is that? I don't know, right? He's not much of a chatterbox, but he's well stocked and cheerful enough. And over to my right is Marlo. Marlo, come say and say hello! Marlo, Sandy just moved into the, old, in the, into the old ranch in the valley. I've heard. Lovely spot. Pleasure to meet you. Marlo's our woodsman. Takes care of the trees around here. Not only that, give the man a stick or a log and he can build pretty much anything with it. Pride of the pines, we call him. 
Nobody calls me that, but I'll admit I'm pretty good with my hands. If there's something you need, I'll do what I can, but there's only so much I can do without my pa proper workshop tools. Speaking of which, any word on the path to Dapplewood, Granny? I haven't checked myself, but I reckon we'd hear about it if anything changed. Well, anyways, love to meet you, Sandy. I got another quest. Hey, since you're fixing up that old ranch, I reckon these could come in handy. Happy housewarming gift for, to you from strong roots come ripe fruits. Well, Marlo, just when I think you couldn't be any nicer, you go and outdo yourself. Enjoy the rest of your day. Ah. Told you Marlo was a decent chap. Those will come in handy, I'm sure. As soon as I've got time, I'll swing by your ranch and show you how to use them. But for now, I'd best be hopping along. Stop by my stall. I might have something for you. I actually do low key when I see you. It's... Oh my god, the controls are so fidgety. <laughs> I might have to adjust it a little bit. Here's me here. Let me give you something to welcome you to Viridian Valley. Bitch, what the fuck? Why'd you push me? Carrot seeds, not much, but better than a tooth in the tail. Can't wait for someone to reopen my way home, though. My garden must be in a terrible state. See anything else that interests you? Let me see what else she has. Uh, spring onion seeds, potato seeds, and carrot seeds. Okay. Anyway, way the way you get you weak. Get? Is that what? <sighs> Can I talk to strangers? <laughs> so this is just NPCs walking around. Oh. Hey there, Sandy. Nice to meet you again. Hope you're selling well. Anything I can do for you? I can get custom orders. Somebody wasn't available at the moment. Uh. Sandy, right? I'm Corlin. Pleasure to meet you. Well, how about it? Buy, sell, what's your fancy? Oh. Saddle. Carnivore. Oh, this is where you can buy the food if you're low. Pompous grass. Problems, let me know. Oh, I have to be careful. Of what the fuck? Why did you just yippee in my ear like that, bruh? This <laughs> is just so excited, and for what? It's crazy. Alright. But I guess I have stamina of my own, so I have to be careful of that. Can I get to any of those houses, or are those just like decoration? I don't think there's really much I can do here, actually. Uh, deliver a notebook. Wood needed. Deliver a hat. Deliver a notebook. I have wood, I think. Didn't I collect wood? I do have wood. Okay, yeah, I can just do that one. I just don't know where the fuck they're at, though. That's the problem. I didn't see them anywhere in town, so I'm assuming they're not here, I don't think. Or at least not at the moment. I haven't been able to go to. Can I go up to this? Nope, that I cannot. Okay. I guess I just head back to my.
has two dinosaurs. Oh, you can you can see where they're at depending on. I actually need to buy food from you. He'll be back. Why does it sound so ominous coming from him though? Whatever. Wait, Sandy. I, I haven't been by the old ranch in years, but from what I heard, it's well. Let's just say it's a bit of a fixer upper. Now, now I don't mean to boast, but fixer uppering is kind of my specialty around here. Let me walk you home, and we'll see if there's any basic maintenance I can help with. Sound good? Cheese balls, really, hun? <laughs> I have you haven't had me say that in a long while. work. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this old place sure brings back memories. Feel a little guilty letting it go to get to such a state. If only you could have seen what it looked like back in the day. Still then is for then, now is for now. Let's see how beautiful this place can be again. Well, if you're s going to start somewhere, it's best to start small. Jesus fucking Christ, that dinosaur just bolted. Might I suggest we begin with Lucky's little patch of paradise. Let me take a closer look here. In the meantime, you could see if you find some old fence posts lying around. Old fence post, huh? all the pieces, I think. Yeah. That should be good enough. Step over here and see if you can take out one of the posts you found. Why don't we start over here? We're stuck with this boulder, at least for now, but we can work around it. Very nice. Maybe another post down at this end? Now, that's looking more like a pen. Shall we complete the loop? There we go. Gorgeous. Not for the finishing touch. Every pin needs a gate. Okay. Where the fuck do I put it though? is a habitable pen and a job well done for your would your lovely steed care to take it for a spin if lucky's happy then i'd say we should be too by the way there's nothing that says this pen needs to stay right here feel free to up sticks and drop it down anywhere on the property easier to move the pen th than the boulder after all if we could move boulders i'd be home by now <laughs> well i best be off give me a shout if you ever need a hand Bye, Sandy. Bye, Lucky. Also, why the I, I want to state that I don't know. I, I like that they went with a more simpler hand design because I feel like that, like, makes the game run a lot smoother, to be fair. What's that? I know, I know. Put some in there for you. Is there anything else 
else I can do? Goodness. Calm down. Come on, Lucky. Where's the damn thing? There it is. Okay, running around will lower their stamina too, apparently. Okay, good to know. Where's the path I need to look at? Assuming my might well, path wait, does kind of vanish, doesn't it? Welcome to my house. Please don't mind the mess. I was expecting visitors today. Oh, you're too kind. So, how is the new house? Have you worked out a plan yet? Wonderful. Planning is the first step, I always say. And usually the longest. Thanks for stopping by. Maybe I'll see you at Pebble Plaza later. If I can ever finish my to-do list, that is. Oh, uh... Hello, Sandy. I'll be with you in a moment. I've just ab about finished a huge entry regarding Warper Sword. Or I don't know how to fucking say that thing's name. <laughs> or Horosaurus's diets. And if I don't write down th this down now, there we go. Thank you for waiting. I just couldn't risk losing my train of thought. While there ha while there there's been while there's been much written on the subject of dinosaurs, it's still vitally important that we record as much as we can. Oh, really? Maria and I would love to share all our findings in a book someday. Unfortunately, like most of my projects, I never quite know when to stop writing. Say, just thinking out loud here, but I believe the mystery of the parasaur might just be a primarily in climax. If reference books had climaxes, that is, well, I think they do. <laughs> oh, fear not. Lucky surely isn't the only parasaur out there even though all evidence points to the contrary. Oh dear, never fear, I just have just the snack that will brighten her up. How about a mango? 
Beyond dinosaur diets, I'm afraid I'm all out of data. Perhaps Granny might offer up some more information? After all, she's lived here the longest. Like I said, just thinking out loud, you must be busy. I'll let you get on with your day. Take this, you've earned it. Okay. On to the dinosaur we go. So I know where he lives now. Melanistic. I can't tell what that is. I hope that one's not melanistic. I don't think it is, but I'll be really upset because I don't think I can get dinosaurs like that yet. Because I know you need like some sort of flute, and I'm not that far in the game to have that. So. I don't know. That's weird. I don't know what you are, but I don't think that's all fine. I think their eyes are red in color. Imagine I found a melanistic and albino like really quickly. That would suck. <laughs> Dad wants me to watch my uh, pizza for a second while he gets changed, so I'll be right back. But okay. Oh, uh, can I not go down? I guess I can't go down. I have to go around. Okay, so no, that is a normal one. Huh, it's like a little watching area, I guess. I genuinely don't have a map. Is there a map? Am I just dumb and there's a map, or is there genuinely no map? Get off of me, Dylan. Ask Granny Agami about the Oh, so now I gotta go back and talk to her again. Path to Dapplewood. Where is Dapplewood, though? Where's the path to Dapplewood? I'm losing my mind trying to figure out where this is. It's not very straightforward. I'm surprised I don't have a map in this game, admittedly. Oh, is this the... It's this, is it? Is that the pathway? Or is that just a random thing? Thank you. 
dinosaurs over there, it looks like. Colors, they have different patterns. That's cute. I like that. Oh no, it looks like the path ahead is blocked. This must be the boulder that Granny and Marla were talking about. It is back here?! Past that boulder right now. Sorry, Lucky. Okay, so that's that. Is this a plant that I can harvest, or am I just losing my mind? Hold up. I don't think it is, but. Check my dinosaurs anyway. <laughs> uh, doesn't seem to show anything, I guess. I don't think that did anything for her either. I guess feeding them doesn't really do anything. Sorry, my head was miles away. What can I get you? How are you sleep on a new ranch, kiddo? I gotta say, Mari could invest in some cozier bed sheets. I'm missing my home comforts. The sooner the path to Applewood gets cleared, the better. You and Lucky seem to be the exploring type. You'd love to Applewood. You're looking for parasaurs, eh? Can't say I've ever seen one myself. But my family have lived in the area for generations. Who knows? Might be something lying around the house that could help your search. Can't know for sure until the path is cleared, though. Sorry, my 
dog is begging and he's like being a little baby. Is that a lock on the tree? <laughs> That's so weird. Oh, you can get different sized crystals too if you need. Okay. So, what am I supposed to do for a pity? Oh. Cancel. Ooh, didn't mean to do that. I will accept that one actually. Thanks so much. Alright, Marlo's quite literally over here. Oh. My notebook, thanks for getting in. I was beginning to think Agami had forgotten. I love that they're literally two steps away from each other. Call me a beetroot. What do you need? Take this. You burned it. Alright, now I gotta go find that one dude, right? This way. Where's this dude's house? Oh, right here. Think? Or is this somebody else's house? Wait a minute. No, this is his house. I'm just dumb and don't have the right direction. Oh, I don't need to talk to you. Who the fuck do I need to talk to? What the hell? Oh, I have to find Mari. I don't even know where she is. So I kind of screwed myself gathering that, huh? Oh. Oh, I, I don't even know how to, like, farm and stuff in the game, but I bet... Figure it out, I suppose.
Okay, the more I look at that dude, the more I'm starting to think that is an albino. If that's actually an albino, I will be mad. I'm not gonna lie to you on that. It's so hard to find my own house. I'm assuming this is like farmland and stuff. Oh, you're too tired to do that, huh? Lucky. Lucky really liked that clover. Okay, so you like clovers. What about a berry? Oh, it's evening now. Okay. So your favorite's probably clovers then. to play this all the time for you, didn't I? Well, why not? Let's have a toodle, shall we? For old time's sake. Oh, so I had to go to the next day. Okay. Alright. Lucky still got it? Mm -hmm. hmm, maybe I never had it. I'll keep practicing. So now I should be able to get a hold of the dinosaur's attention. Oh, 
Mark my branches. Did you hear that noise just now, or am I going flappy? Oh, that was you? Well, keep practicing. You'll get there one day. Alrighty-roo. I woke up itching like a itchy the sore to plant some seeds this morning. I also literally woke up itching. Mari's spare bed gives me the scritchies. But it'll have to do until I can get back home. Do it. Come on. Come on. No time to dawdle. Alright. Come on. Get your hoe out. That handy wee host gets the soil ready for seeding. Very important step. So go on, take a swing. Dylan. I love you, buddy. But please. Looks like you've done this before. Would you get stop begging on me? <laughs> Dylan. all over the place, dude. Gross. Alright, intend to plant the goods. I bought, brought a few seeds just to get you started. Carrot seeds? Oh my. Well, go on. Smell those carrots already. Maybe I should stand back. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. You're not done yet. You've got that watering can Marla gave you? Go on, whip it out. Very nice, but you can't water without water, can you? There's a pond over there. That should do the trick. Alright, time to get muddy. You are literally making this so much harder than it needs to be, dude, right now. He backed away knowing he messed up just now. Well, look at you. You're practically a farmer now. Listen, a couple of top tips before I leave you to your whatnots. Number one, don't forget the seeds, because nobody's going to buy a patch of wet dirt. Number two, water your crops every day. Well, you can skip the rainy ones, but you get what I mean. Finally, you might be surprised to discover what dinosaurs can do. I've lived here longer than anybody, and I've seen helposaurs of all shapes and sizes. Why, I bet, I'll bet Lucky has got some helpful skill. Look at those beautiful claws. I'll bet you're a digger, ain't ya? Atta girl. Tell you what, soon though, as those carrots have sprouted, come tell me and we'll celebrate you t being a fully fledged farmer. Well, you picked that up speedier than a Styroscosaurus. Styroscosaurus? What? I'm off to Pebble Plaza. Come say hello soon, kiddo. Well, now I know I can, like, actually get information from dinosaurs. Mm. It won't fuck up and make me use my seeds in a spot that, that you literally can't do anything with. Mm -hmm. 
Bruh. Okay. Ah. There. Oh my goodness. Dylan! Come on, dude. Go. Sorry, he's actually making me mad because he's getting drool all over me and it, he doesn't he keeps pushing my arm and it's messing me up.